Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Shauna and this is a fashion channel. Fashion that you can wear into the office, fashion that you can wear on the weekend. I'm smiling because if you're not new here, you're probably like, oh, this is different. Yes, I did my hair a little bit different. Um, and I'm only wearing it down for this video. Um, I've been wearing it like back or up or in a ponytail because I am like, I feel like it's just very weird this way. Um, this is what I wanted. I, I asked for like a, like some sort of a curly bob and that's what I got, but um, it's weird for me. Like I, I'm very stable like or consistent when it comes to certain things. I like repeat things that I love and when I do something different, I have to get used to it. So I'm getting used to it, um, but I'm getting a lot of good feedback on Instagram that, you know, Okay, okay, okay. Um, and I will leave the person who braids my hair um, in the description box below as well. If anyone asks, she's a Brooklyn hair braider. Um, really good. And um, my hair has grown a lot since I started getting braids. I'm really getting braids because it's just easier for me. Work is like crazy. Everything else is going on and I don't have time to sit in the salon as often as I did before. Um, and I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair, honestly. I, I don't know if I'm gonna just rock it natural for a while go to the relaxer again, because I did have a relaxer, go shortly, but I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Anyway, let's get into today's video, which is gonna be just a, little, a combination of a few things because um, your girl been out. Your girl's been out, 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 okay? I've been going out. Um, so first up, let me move here. I think I'm gonna do the pop-up here. Um, first up, I went to a pop-up shop in Soho for a brand GSTQ. Never heard of them before. Um, this was a short little like partnership that I did on Instagram just for a couple of IG stories. So I went there, loved the brand, met the owner, really nice space. Um, and this was a pop-up shop. They do um, sell online. This just happened to be like for a week or so. And the pop-up shop has ended. Um, I was gifted one item and then I purchased two things that I loved on top of that. So, um, the black wraparound dress, which is the dress that I'm going to be showing right now. I was gifted that. I love this dress. If you've been following me for a while, you know that like this is my style. I love those fit and flare looks and this like kind of met it. I wish they would have had this in more colors because I definitely would have bought, purchased more than one or got more than one. Um, this buttons really like, um, like snap buttons, not the, the closure, but just the snap buttons. You can tie it in the front and you can tie it in the back. It has pockets. It is that nice, like good. It's like, it feels like a, a coat or a jacket, but it's not a jacket. You can wear it as a dress. I have already worn this. I wore it to work already. And that's how you can tell you really love something when you just like, I want to wear it right now, right now. I wore it. Um, I put like a nice white t-shirt underneath it. I wore some shorts underneath because it's not that warm yet in New York City. Pairing them with my Stuart Weissman boots. These boots did go on sale. If they are still available, I will leave them linked in the description box below. Also that I got from them are these two dresses. I have them on the same hanger because I'm like running out of hangers, honestly. Um, these two dresses I got, if you love something, buy it in multiple colors. That's, that's normally just what we do. Um, so I tried on the black and, and blue one and I thought it was like really, really cute. So I ended up picking up the khaki and black one as well. These also have pockets, the pocket zip. I feel like this is like, there was a word that I heard used, um, power casual, because like a lot of us are going back into the office, but we're not going back in stilettos. We're just not doing it. I, we're not doing it. So power casual is like, um, we were so used to like working from home and wearing like our comfy clothes and everything, but now we got to go back into the office. So we got to wear something that's office-y, but we still want to be comfortable. And that's like the power casual. So I'm in the office, but I'm still cute and casual. And this is definitely something that meets that. I love the zip that it zips all the way up. Um, and the zippers are on the bottom and the top. So you can like, you know, show a little bit on the top. You can show a little leg on the bottom. This is really like, I loved, love, love this brand. At the, on the Instagram page, there were some like custom made pieces that she made for people and they those colors just popped, really, really popped. So I will leave the brand, I will leave the link to the website, the description box and everything. I will leave all that stuff in the description box below and definitely, definitely check out GSTQ. Um, you will see these looks in a get ready with me near you. 
So after that, after that, I went by Veronica Beard. Oh God, you guys know how I feel about Veronica Beard. I mean, my Lord, just, just let's just get married. I love that brand. Those blazers are blazers that were made for me. I, I, I am the mold. Like, they fit me so perfect. I like size six. It's me. Just call it the Shauna Six. That's it. What size do you need, Shauna? Because I love this brand. Um, so I went in there just to see like what pieces they had. And girl, girl. I'm gonna show you a few things that I tried on that I just, I wanted to buy so bad. I just ran out the store. I just ran out the store. So first is this red leather short sleeve blazer. And I need you guys to let me know in the comments which one, cause I, I wanna get maybe one or two, but I gotta make sure it's worth it, worth it. I mean, they're, they're amazing, they feel good, the quality, everything, but I gotta make sure. These are investments, okay? Investment blazers so the red short sleeve one I had an I had on a pair of jeans at the time that I went and it just went so well um so I know this will really look good with jeans I'm sure I can wear it into work it's short sleeve it's leather it's not heavy heavy leather um but it is leather um so I'm trying to think like how long into the summer that I'm going to be able to wear this I could probably wear it throughout because it's short sleeve even though it's leather the buttons are amazing I do a timer so I know not to like ramble too much. So my timer went off. Um, the buttons are amazing. And the price of this blazer is $12.98, $12.98, okay? Um, I can manage to get a little bit of discount. Depends if you buy a full price on the website, you put a new email address, you can get 15% off. There are ways that you can get a little bit of a discount, but $12.98. Number two, the white leather blazer. Um, this blazer I absolutely loved. It was long sleeve, it's white, it's like a shorter blazer than the than the than the red one. Um they also have this in like a vegan leather. I didn't feel it. So I don't know the difference between vegan leather and real leather. I'm not sure, but this is like a soft, when I tell you like buttery leather, like these are like a buttery leather. This is the same price as the red one. Um but I, I love them both. I love them both. And do I say, you know what, just get it. Just get them both. Or am I like, Shauna, slow down. Because they're both leather. They're both leather. But they're like forever blazers. They will last a long time, as long as I don't gain any weight. Okay? Number three, this like trench sleeveless coat, uh, jacket. Oh my God, the sides of this jacket were amazing. Again, quality is like an 11. On a scale of one to 10, quality is an 11. So like, there's no questions about the quality. I love that it's unique. I love that it splits on the side. I can wear this a lot. I can get a lot of wear out of this. Um, I can wear it into work. I can wear it with something underneath, so I don't have to worry about it not having sleeves and me being cold, because I could just wear a long sleeve shirt underneath. I can wear this over my dresses. Um, I could really get a lot of wear out of this. The cost of this is $6.98, um, and I love it. I, I, love, I love everything. These are like my favorite four pieces, um, because we have one more coming up. So the next one coming up is the Miller Blazer. They call them jackets, but I call them blazers, the Miller jacket. Um, and I, I love this jacket. I feel like it just screams, why me, why me, why me? I love this jacket. Um, and I can get a lot of wear out of this, of course. It's a blue blazer. I have a blue corduroy blazer, but I don't have a blue solid blazer. Um, that or a, uh, I have the black long blazer. It's like a blazer dress that's linen that I wear, but I don't have a blue solid blazer. So guys, let me know. The red, I probably have to get two. I think I have to get two out of these. The red blazer, the red short sleeve leather blazer, the white long sleeve leather blazer, the khaki trench jacket coat, or the blue blazer. 
They're all different. They're all so different. I feel like that scene in the Devil Wears Prada. They're all so different. Those, those shirts are just blue, those belts just blue. <sighs> so, and I did get something from my friends at Veronica Beard. I got a gifted um, blazer that I'm gonna show you guys. And um, this is a linen blazer. I, I love this too. This is nice fitting on the waist area. It flares on the bottom and flares on the in the back. This is really cute, this color. <sighs> Listen, I, that's what I said, just put me on a billboard. They don't even gotta pay me, just give me clothes. That's it, you don't even have to pay me. Just put me in a billboard, I will find a way to make. I thought that was a braid, but that's, oh, okay. I thought that was a braid sticking out. Yeah, just put me on. I want it all. I want it all. I want everything. Everything I want. <laughs> um, what else? Okay, so that was my Saturday. Sunday, I went, I ended up in Woodbury. So let me tell you guys this story and then we're going to wrap up the video after this. So I went to Bloomingdale's last year. I think it was like November. And I got my Stuart Weitzman combat boots and I got these Dior loafers that were $1,100 that I never told anyone about. I never, I, I, listen, I, I am dipping my toe into like luxury and it's, it changes you a little bit. And I, I, it's hard to even explain and I did have a Gucci bag before. I had a horrible experience buying that Gucci bag. So, um, and I could save that for like another story. Um, I don't know if you guys want to hear it. Let me know in the comment section if you want to hear it. And I'll add it at the end of the, of like one of my videos. Cause it, I don't know. I don't know if I should say it. Um, yeah, it was a story. It was a story. Um, but anyway, I, so I got these Dior loafers. And I, I got a deal on them. I got like a, a huge deal. It was, I had like PowerPoint. I had a discount. So I didn't fully pay $1,100 for them. But I got them and I was so nervous to wear them. So I, I normally wear like a nine and a half, ten. I got them in a nine and a half. And I, I wore them around the house. And I'm like, do they really fit? I don't want to step outside on the ground if they don't fit right. Because I'm not going to be able to return them. And I like I was so nervous to put these $1,100 shoes on. I've never owned any shoes that were $1,100. Um, so I was nervous. I, I, and this is like a real authentic, like story of someone who's getting into luxury, but not, like you get, you're scared. Like you're, you're like, I don't want to mess them up. I don't like all these things were going through my head that I let these shoes sit for, I remember December, January, five months. I let them sit for five months. I never wore them. They're still in the dust bag. Five months. Let me show you them. Five months, never wore them. Um, and they're brand new, brand new, never worn. So I was nervous with them. I was really nervous. So I was, so I woke up Sunday and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just return them. Cause I, 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 maybe I'll get a bag and I'll feel a little bit more comfortable with the bag, but I just don't feel comfortable with $1,100 shoes. So I go to Bloomingdale's and I didn't get out. I didn't go inside because before I went inside, I checked the return policy to make sure I'm like, I'm going in a store and I'm returning $1,100 shoes. Let me make sure everything is together. And you cannot return after 90 days. So I, I'm not able to return these shoes. So I have them. Um, they're, we're, guys know how much I pay for them. A 39 and a half and I was not able to return them. So I was disappointed that I waited so long. Um, a lot of times I get very indecisive with things. So um, I, I, it's my fault. Um, I just sat there and looked at them for five months. I put them on a few times when I was doing my outfit of the days. I'm like, these would go really good with the Christian Dior loafers. And then I'm like, no, I'm not wearing them yet. I'm not wearing them yet. You keep saving things for like a special occasion. I um, mean, I always say like every day is a special occasion, but I did not listen to my own advice and I did not wear these. So I was in the city. I was like, you know what? Um, I'm just going to go back home. I can't return these. So 
I went to go back home, but the marathon was happening and it was so much, you know, traffic and so many roads closed off for the marathon that I ended up on the Lincoln Tunnel and I ended up in New Jersey. So because I was in New Jersey, I decided to go to Woodbury. And I went to Woodbury and I did get some Loewe um, shoes that I like. I'm going to show you guys those shoes. So these are them. These are, that's a little symbol up top. There you go, see the little symbol. And these are them. Now, um, some people said these remind them of like wallabies, and it does remind me of wallabies in the beginning. I love shoes like this. I'm, if you haven't noticed, I'm really into comfort for my, for my feet. I, I wear heels here and there, but I don't do it too much because I have um, like bursitis in my hip. I had pain in my knee. I went to the doctor, this was years ago, and it turned out that it was bursitis. And I got it from waitressing for years holding the tray on the side of my body and not holding it properly and resting a lot of weight on my hip over and over and over and over and over again. So um, I had to get a cortisone injection. You can uh, treat it with like just aspirin or Aleve, but I'm allergic to aspirin or Aleve. It will kill me. I, I'm, I'm, de I'm deadly allergic to ibuprofen and um, aspirin. I can't take either of those things. So no Bayer's, no Motrum, no like certain Theraflu's, aspirin cream. Um, icy hot like all those things have aspirin in it because they're designed to like thin the blood and I can't take any of those so um, for that reason I don't um, here and there it will flare up so I don't wear heels constantly and I'm always looking for like really good comfortable shoes that won't put like so much pressure on my foot because I think they're all connected like of course they're connected the leg the knee the hip um, so this is one of the reasons why I like were drawn to these. These are super cute. Um, I paid $316 for these. Originally, I think they were like six or $700, but it was the outlet. Um, they had some other nice things there. The designer outlets I think are really, really good. Um, most times, sometimes they hit, sometimes they don't. But um, I think that is it. I also tried on some blazers at Max Mara, Max Mara that were really, really cute, um, expensive, a little bit more expensive than Veronica Beard, um, but they didn't have my size in the blazer that I really liked. Even if they did have my size, I don't know if I would have paid that much for a blazer at an outlet. Usually at outlets, they're like final sales, not really much that you can do with it. Um, and that was it. I just went up to Woodbury, I got these shoes, I looked around a little bit more and I came back home. Excuse me, and that was the end of my weekend. That's it. So thank you guys so much. Um, just a quick heads up, Saks. Saks is, and I'm gonna wear these. I'm gonna wear these. I'm not gonna keep these in the dust bag for five months. Um, Saks is having their friends and family sale. I will leave um, links to a few of the things that I am loving. I did purchase a couple of pieces. I purchased a Veronica Beard blazer from Saks. You'll see it when I get it. You'll see it when I get it. But I did purchase a couple of things from the sale. Um, and I will leave a link of just a few of my favorites and some other things in the description box. But I have a little party in the description box. Hey. Okay. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I feel like this video was a little rambly. But um, just wanted to share like what I did this weekend and things that happened or whatever. Um, for more like of me and just a little bit more daily updates and a little bit more consistency. Um, with like just every day what I'm doing. Follow me on Instagram, Simply Shauna. Um, my videos here are once a week. I'm definitely gonna try to go up a little bit more on the videos because lots is going on. And once like the weather gets warm, I just feel better and I wanna like chat more and like things like that. You know, you're shopping, you're doing a lot of things. So uh, thank you guys so much. Um, and that's it. That's it. This, this um, jacket is from Zara's. If it's still available, I will link it in the description box too. And I feel so like girly with this hair. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next video.